guys what is up this is king sam yd and i highly welcome you to the official youtube channel king sam graphics here i help people to unleash the creativity in them in terms of smartphone graphic designing you have no idea the kind of designs you can do using smartphone flyer design logos picture editing a whole lot using smartphone so if you want to join us in this journey of smartphone graphic designing consider subscribing to this channel then turn off the notification bell so the moment I upload new contents you'll be the first person to be alerted all right so today i'm going to show you how to design 2022 calendar in puzzle Lab. so kindly take your time and then go through the video to get a full understanding before you quit and start your own design without further ado let's jump right into it all right so i will leave all the resources right in the description so you can go ahead and check them out to assist you in your design okay so let's get into business go ahead and delete this test because you don't need it at the moment okay and then change the image size to okay so you're using the custom image size the width and then the height change the width to be um 3508 and then the height to be 4961 pixels okay so this is the image we are using okay so the next thing we have to do is customize our shape so let's use the bezier tool right here okay and then click on this to adjust our shape right here so we are adjusting it using the bezier tool you can adjust to, to see it your taste so please pay particular attention to what i'm doing to really guide you in your design okay so we'll click on this one again and then click on any part of the screen this way can you see it good and you can click on this one again to adjust it this way okay so take your time to do this work it's really going to help you okay good okay so if you are comfortable or if you are okay with the shape you've got and you can continue with it okay so see this is okay for me just click on this click on any part of the screen again and then click on this one this is very necessary click on this one this way you see the shape is being closed okay and then click on opacity with 200 percent to fill the shape and then reduce the stroke all the way to zero this way and then click on the check mark right there so you can put it this way you can rotate it to um play around the shape okay you go ahead and lock it for the meantime and then click on shapes so we have this rectangle right here and then increase the radius here to 10 percent okay to 10 percent this way and then enlarge it this way enlarge it that way okay you can move it a bit upwards this way and then use the ability position to position it very nicely in the middle good go ahead and then lock it this way and then move this one on top so let's adjust this once again so that it doesn't interfere with the shape we just added also okay okay so i think this way is cool this way is cool go ahead and lock it okay so the next thing we are going to do is to bring in our calendar this way to this customer shape right there so click on this shape right there and then go to texture texture into your gallery so i have my um calendar right there you can crop it this way to remove the um unnecessary part right from it you can crop it okay so see this way okay so this way your calendar is being added to the shape right there as a texture but you can see uh, it's not proportioned simply because um 
you've not enabled the maintain ratio so you just click on maintain ratio to check it's been enabled you will see the calendar is now in the right proportion okay so go ahead and click on this checkpoint right there check mark okay so click on this once again and then change the color to blue you have this blue color here change it to this color okay and then go ahead and copy it this way and then change the color to yellow this yellow right here position this one beneath this one okay and then adjust it this way okay this is good for me and then go ahead and lock it good so we are done with our uh, two shapes right here let's um work on the background right now okay so go ahead and import an image from your gallery i have um, an image right there from my gallery this image okay the next thing you're going to do is try to enlarge the image way to cover the whole screen okay this way good and then reduce the opacity reduce the opacity to around 40 okay and then send it way back to the screen this way and then lock it good go ahead and copy it copy the image this way and then bring the opacity back to 100 percent sorry the opacity back to 100 percent this way okay reduce the size Read the size again. It is the size. Okay. So this time around, we want to position this one somewhere here. Okay, so it should go one step further. Okay, so bring this one on top of this this way. Can you see it? Good. <clears throat> so we have uh, our background being set um, with business presentation right going on so the next thing you're going to do is let's add some test to make our work being complete okay so just click on add test this way and then type in 2022 okay this way and then change the font to this font right here the heavy task this font okay and then click on this check mark right there reduce the size to this one okay reduce the size reduce the size to this okay so you can adjust this to okay so you can adjust it to see what you're doing okay just take your time and do the work all right so go ahead and copy this one this way and then click on edit and then type in calendar okay capitalize it this way and then reduce the size And the position very nicely on the screen very very nicely on the screen okay so we have our 2022 calendar right here cool so go ahead and lock the two so i want to add my logo right to this flyer right here so go ahead and click one from gallery Okay, so I have my logo right here. Can adjust it this way. All right. So go ahead and then change the color to white. I want to make the contrast between the background and then the image very good to really see what is going on. Okay. So change the color to white this way to make it very visible, and then lock it good so the next thing i have to do is i want to add some social media handle my social media handles right to 
what i've done so just click on edit this way so i'm um, on instagram as can some graphics could really follow my page on instagram twitter and then facebook for more updates so can some graphics can some graphics on instagram okay so this way the font is the same font as this one so it's right there the heavy task okay can go ahead and reduce the size okay so this way go ahead and copy it the same thing on twitter and then facebook so go ahead and then follow my page right on twitter facebook and then instagram asking some graphics okay let me position that one to right there so basically this is how to create calendar in puzzle lab very very simple if you take time to go through as i said you have no idea what your smartphone can do so really learn this skill very very um it's very very necessary okay thank you and see you minus upload